Whether it's the hedge you see out of your window or the hedge you see on your weekend countryside walk, there are furry friends everywhere. But for some species, like hedgehogs, there are not enough wildlife barriers for them to live in. I'm here with Oliver, one of the many Arla farmers in the UK who's been on a bit of a hedge growing mission. Who in particular do the hedgerows benefit in wildlife wise? So uh, all the small species, hedgehogs especially, small field mice, bugs, beetles, and also as well bees. Why are hedgerows so important to our ecosystems? They just create this natural break in the countryside. And they create this small, really intense, populated habitat for, for small mammals and, and hedgehogs. What's happening here then? This is a new area of woodland that, that we've recently established. We've got everything from hedges and hedgehogs and hedgerows. What does it mean to be an Isle Care farmer? It's a set of uh, high standards that we set and it stands for cooperative, which is us as farmers, yep. uh, stands for animal welfare, welfare, renewable energy and ecosystems. So we're already doing a fantastic job in planting and maintaining hedgerows which act as wildlife corridors for Britain's declining species. Look out for the care stamp on Arla Cravendale, Arla Bob and Arla Big Milks. So that's how Oliver and other Arla farmers are helping to give wildlife, just like our little hedgehogs, a safe haven. For anybody that's interested they can go onto the Arla website, have some great information of what you can get involved in and, and do at home. Oh, sounds good to me. So whether your garden is as big as Ollie's is here, we've got a tiny little roof terrace in the city. You can go green, help wildlife, and have a good time while you do it. <laughs>